Hello Aquarius, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley. I'm going to do another what's in your energy spread for you all. This is going to be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Happy, happy Aquarius season, my lovelies. We're going to do an energy spread today, so it, I don't know what's going to pop up, but we will see. If <laughs> This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. It will not resonate with all y'all out there. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If it is not your story, it is simply not your story. Very, very important to remember not to force it. If it's not, take what resonates, leave what doesn't for who it was meant to reach. I can't elaborate enough. Please, please, please don't force it if it's not your story. As sometimes I tend to see a lot of, um, I, I, I tend to see too deep into something sometimes. Let's see. Aquarius, let's see what's going on, my lovelies. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. Um, for those of you, if you are new here, I did have a special a while back, and I did decide to bring it back because you all enjoyed it so much. So it is a $25 energy spread. It's similar to this, exactly what I do on the channel, and it's whatever is in your energy. So let's go ahead and get started this is your energy aquarius this is your surrounding and this is the mutual <clears throat> they're telling me to start over here in your surrounding love in your surrounding energy aquarius you have the knight of wands in reverse the lovers in reverse the justice in reverse and the king of wands Ooh, this is weird Is this about getting even? No. What is that Knight of Wands in reverse? Is this Aquarius? No. There's someone in your energy, Aquarius. It's very strange. There's someone in your energy. It's a player or player at energy. Knight of Wands in reverse. Ooh. Knight of Wands in reverse to me is someone very impulsive, very in and out, very uncommittal, non-communicative, very hot and cold. This is also the player, player at energy. This is in your surrounding. Now remember, loves, we still are in Venus and Mercury retrograde, so um, old exes, old flings, old triggers, old traumas, they all come back during this period, okay? Um, and for you, I believe that this is someone... That definitely drives you a little mad. Definitely drives you a little nuts, okay? This could be... It's possible that you've already... Let me ask this. Is this an X? I think this is someone that you're... Is this someone that they're dealing with right now? Is this someone from their past? This is someone from your past. It may not be an ex per se. I like maybe you don't have an official title with this person, but you do have history with this person. Okay, this person's very in and out. Ooh, for some of y'all, this is like a mother or a father, or maybe perhaps like a mother, like a mother or father of your children. Ooh, that's what it is. In your surrounding energy, Aquarius, it's like in and out of someone's life, right? In and out of someone's life. For some of you, you have teenagers, like teen kids. Or for some of you, um, this is someone who still has a very teenage mentality, you know? Um, like an adult who just hasn't matured just yet. With the true love here, the lovers in reverse, you could be done with a Gemini, you could be done with a Leo, a Libra. Um, a Pisces, a Scorpio, a Sagittarius. <clears throat> Doesn't have to be, but definitely could be. Aquarius, this is someone that you have detached from. There has been some distance between you and someone, okay? This is someone that is either far away from you, literally at a distance, or someone who it has been a distance. There's like, there's like a gap there, like a time gap. There's some like time missed out, right? And in the surrounding energy, loves, I think that you or this person are definitely going to take the initiative to make things right, to make things better. The justice is here. Making it balanced, making it equal, making it even. Putting things back in harmony. Putting things 
back on the right track and forward movement with this king of wands this is something that you're passionate about and this is something that you're going to take charge of and do so okay this is about rekindling a connection whether it be from your past a lover an ex whatever it may be this is about <clears throat> taking a whiff of fresh air and literally trying to make things right i just heard like i just smelled like the laundry um, like laundry detergent, but however, I'm also like like taking like, for some of you, this has to do with home life. For some of you, this is like a new beginning in your home matters or home life or home situation. This is something that you're passionate about that you're willing to go towards now and make things correctly because there has been missed out time. I'm getting strongly this has to do with a child love. Oh, I got the chills. Aquarius. Over here in your in your energy, page of cups in reverse, the temperance, the death, and the nine of swords. I'm getting strongly. This is about rekindling a connection, reconciling a situation with a person. It doesn't have to be a lover because I'm not seeing cups here. There's one here, but I, I'm not seeing too much, okay? Um, <clears throat> with the page of cups in reverse, pages are children energy. They're innocent energy. They're premature energy immature energy the page of cups in reverse i'm getting strongly love like you feel upset about something you feel bad maybe about missing out on time missing out on experiences missing out on certain things that you should have been there for or could have been there for right and i'm getting strongly this has to do with like adolescence like from like like tiny baby steps to coming into adulthood i don't know if you've been absent from a child's life or if someone has been keeping you from from one of your children something like that and Aquarius your readings lately have been about children um yeah I definitely feel like you feel like this person doesn't love you or you feel like this person feels like you don't love them because you've been absent because you may have been missing not that you've been absent or missing but perhaps there's just barriers here from keeping you from spending time. I just heard the name Samantha. There's something about the letter S for sure. And with the temperance card here, it's like you want harmony. You want peace. You want to come together. Ooh, I just heard that song, Just the Two of Us. You know, just the two of us, you know. We can make it if we try. And that's what I'm hearing. That's what I'm seeing. You want peace. You want harmony. And you want collaboration on both ends because you want to come to a completion, right? This is your wish fulfillment. And this is what will make you happy as well as this person. This is probably like, this person I think is a child. I think this person looks like you. Like I just heard your mini, your mini, right? Or this person wants to be like you or, or it like you want the connection to go better. You want to soar in this connection, right? Like you want to leave the smoke screen behind, leave the past in the past and let's move forward, right? Because there is a cycle closing here with the death card. Um, it could be dealing with a Scorpio. There is a, I just keep seeing that S everywhere, S, S. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. <clears throat> um, and something about like a big smile, like a big, big smile. Um, this is like your little, like I keep hearing your little mini, your little mini. Aquarius, I definitely feel like there is a cycle coming to a close, right? Look at the waves are slowly dying out. Things are dying down, right? Whether it be drama, whether it be issues, whether it be chaos in your life, that's been a barrier here. And the nine of swords in reverse, I'm, ooh, that one fell completely. Let me get that. Yeah, it's almost like the time has slipped through your fingers, Aquarius. With the Nine of Swords here in reverse, this tells me that there's not going to be many more sleepless nights. You're not going to stress about the situation anymore. You nor this person. I think that you both are going to come out of a period of why. You know, asking why, asking what if, right? I, I, I'm getting strongly like you both can start anew. This isn't going to be something that you worry about moving forward. Aquarius, in the mutual energy, you have the four of cups in reverse and you have the nine of cups. 
someone may have felt rejected or sad or disappointed, right? This person, you or the both of you, it's almost as if like it was like, it was like a moment of time where it just didn't feel like you or it didn't feel like this person. Like it just feels like you're, you're sad about missed time or missed opportunities and the memories you haven't made or didn't get a chance to make. Be, but I'm getting strongly there was like something going on. Um, with the four of cups in reverse, this tells me you're coming out of that sadness. You're coming out of feeling that rejection or this person is. You're coming out of those disappointments, right? Because now you're getting up. Look at here. It's almost like they're letting the cup spill. Now you're coming out of that energy. You're coming out of that stagnancy of that period of, I just heard self-loathing, whether it be you or this person. And now look at what you're headed towards. The Nine of Cups, that happy home, that feeling contentment, that wish fulfillment. For some of you, it was a mother or a father um, of your child that was keeping you from seeing them. I do see that very strongly. Um, I just heard shark, like a shark, like a shark in a minnow. I don't know. Um, there is someone who was keeping that barrier, right? Someone who was keeping that barrier from your wish fulfillment. I do see that coming to an end because you're focusing on that happy family. Underneath the deck, what you don't see coming, what you don't expect, the six of coins in reverse. This tells me that there is equal, things are equalizing themselves out. Things are coming into balance. They're coming into fruition. There's going to be an equal give and take in harmony. Harmony. That's what it is, and that's what's coming forward. Woo, Aquarius, I love it. I love it. That's what I want to hear, and that's what I love to see. So <clears throat> your wish fulfillment is coming. If this is resonating with you, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. Show me some moon messages for Aquarius, please. No one wants us together. Like I said, there was some barriers here. Someone was definitely keeping you apart, you two apart. Cleanse and purge, right? You're getting rid of the past, clearing the energy, clearing the bad times, clearing the times that have been missed, right? You're purging all that stuff and you're cleansing it. Why? Because you're headed towards your wish fulfillment. You're headed towards your happy home, your happy life, your happy family. And we have past life. I think that you've been in this same situation many times. Ooh, I almost said a name. I almost said a name. Oh my goodness. It was a male's name that starts with F. Um, Aquarius, I definitely feel like you have been in the same situation with the same exact people and, and persons um, for many lifetimes. You have past life, right? And I think this time is when you make things right and you make things balanced, right? Th this time you and whoever else is involved are on the same page and you're healing curses, you're healing traumas, generational Karm, you know, karmic generation lines, bringing it into balance this lifetime. Because look, the true love. This this could even be a past life in reverse. This, you've been in this situation many, many lifetimes, and I think in this life you're about to get it right. Things are about to be cleansed, purged, and equalized. Oh my goodness, that is what I have for you, Aquarius. I hope this house. I hope it resonates. I'm so glad this was a good, good reading for you all because I know y'all been going through it. But that is what I have. I am sending you lots of love, light, peace, clarity. May peace always surround you. I love you all so much and I will talk to you soon.